hey guys welcome myself back to my own channel so what's going on today excuse me what's going on today is i am going to do a get ready i'm going to do a get ready with me and um i'm gonna show you how i took these photos in this dress so now today's get ready with me is the get ready with me with the duck dress and I'm excited because I actually made the dress and I have a video on that if you want to go see it check it out and also if you want to see the finished photo shoot that I did check that out on Instagram so other video Instagram and welcome along all right, so we're gonna get started. The first thing we're gonna do is try to stop looking to the side and look directly at you. Hi. The second thing we're gonna do is just put on our foundation. So, um, I said this in another video before, but just in case you're new here, hi. My name is Divine. I'm new to this. I speak very softly sometimes and you can't really hear me all the time. Sorry. But I also have no idea what I'm doing with makeup, so I'm going to do my makeup how I am going to do my makeup for this photo shoot, but I am not a beauty guru at all. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm probably going to trigger a lot of beauty gurus if they watch this, but the point is I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just having fun with the makeup and don't really take everything I do. Seriously. It's serious, but it's for serious for me, not for that. Okay, so I already primed my face, doesn't look like it, but I did. And I'm just gonna put on my foundation. So you see, like stuff like this, me putting on my foundation like this probably triggers a lot of people because you're not supposed to. But I'm doing it, so what you gonna do? Just and I'm just gonna blend this out. foundation poorly but effective enough for the photo shoot we are going to move on and we are going to what are we going to do uh, I guess we're gonna do our eyes I'm gonna use the same black palette if you watched my other video on how I did my little gothic makeover you know that this palette betrayed me and spilled all over my white rug. So yeah, that was terrible. We're gonna go in the palette, we're gonna go into the light shimmery section over here, and put that all over the eyelid. Now that I've done the lighter part on my eyelids, I'm going to do a dark brown on the outer crease. Carefully this time. I'm going to do so I'm going to use a sheet of paper and line it up to match my crease. And then just put the brown where we want it to go. Hold it there. I did that. Take my brown. the brown 
is metallic lip gloss. And I got it from the beauty supply store. It's metallic lip gloss, and I'm going to use it. It's orange, but it, I'm going to make it show up yellow in the photos. Mascara. I do not know how to put on eyelashes. If I could, I would. Because eyelashes make everything better. But I'm going to just use a buttload of mascara right now. Because that's all I know how to do. In this situation, makeup wipes. Makeup wipes are my best friend. So now, go back with this. Okay, now that we've got that, I think my lips are okay, but I'm still gonna add some color to them. I'm gonna just highlight. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is add this really old lipstick. There's literally no brand on it because it's so worn off, but I'm going to add a little bit of this red lipstick, but just until it makes my lips really pink. that I like to use is this Argan Oil lip gloss. There you go. So Argan Oil. It's really glossy, really good for moisturization. 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 That last one was it. All right, so we add the lip gloss to the lips. We can't do a duck review with a duck dress without doing the duck face. I'm done. Okay. So I am just going to add my wig and then put on my jewelry and my dress. And then yeah. Well first I'm gonna put on the wig. So I'm gonna use this bone straight wig, human hair from Amazon. It's 
got clips in it, but also it has lace in the front right here. Lace, and I'm going to add glue to there before I take my pictures. Go get a brush. Okay, so I'm back. I got my wig brush. Just brushing it out. And I'm just gonna glue it onto my head a little later. And then put on the dress. So, yeah. Here is the makeup and hair. Can I just say thank you so much for watching up to this point. Um, if you're still here, uh, make sure you like, subscribe, check out my other videos on how I actually made the dress that I'm going to show you in just a second. You can check out my Instagram for more pictures of the dress and you can just check out my Etsy. I do sell things on Etsy um, in case you want to check that. Like I said, thank you so much for watching up until this point and right now I'm just going to show you how I put on the dress and that's it. Okay, so really quick you've seen the dress. Alright, so really quickly I have the dress on now. I will show you a full body image in a second after I get my accessories on. So, if you haven't seen my video, I made this. It's a headband. It's on my head like that. Okay. And then I also made some earrings to put on. So, this on my head. This is crazy to me. I look so crazy. I love it. I love it. I look insane. Okay. Be careful. I don't know how strong this dress is, so I'm gonna be careful when I'm bending and stuff. But I have a, ne a necklace and it bracelets. And I've got these earrings that I made with mom. Okay, and Ooh, hard to get into my ear. There you go. Oh my god, this is crazy. Oh, this is I'm not even done yet, but we're gonna add the other earring. This is insane. This is better than I imagined. So, that goes in. We have bigger earrings to put in to our second hole. I do have a second hole. Now it's time for me to take this photo shoot. I am excited and nervous. So here I go.
Thank you.